not interrupt me when I'm daydreaming. When the zebra's in the zone, leave him alone. Come on, Marty. Just wanted to wish you a happy birthday. Hey, man, thanks. Oh, ah, oh, hey, um, I got, I got something stuck in my teeth. It's driving me crazy. Can you help me out here, please? Ah, you came to the right place, my friend. Dr. Marty, DDS is in the house. Please hop on top of my sterilized examination table, if you may. I don't see anything. He's on the left. Ah! Oh, all right. Okay, just don't talk with your mouth full. Ah! Right here. What the heck is this doing in there? Happy birthday! Oh, hey, thanks, man. You put it behind the tube. You all right. These aren't even on the shelf yet. Here, check it out. Check it out. Look at that. Ooh, look at that. Ooh. All right, everyone. Today, we're going to start with a mighty creature. Can anyone guess who this is? That's correct. This majestic creature is indeed a lion. Come on, kids. Let's join together to practice that word. L-I-O-N, lion. Excellent. Lions are known as the kings of the jungle. You guys already know that, right? Then can anyone think of any other interesting facts about lions? Absolutely. Lions have a powerful roar that can be heard from miles away. It's their way of communicating and asserting their presence. Okay, kids, let's listen to the powerful roaring sound of the lion. <coughs> <coughs> Isn't that a thrilling and mighty roaring sound? All right, children. Now, can anyone think of another fascinating fact about lions? Excellent observation. Lions are social animals that live in prides, which consist of several lionesses, their cubs, and a few male lions. Can you think of another interesting fact about lions? You're absolutely right. Lions are apex predators and have developed incredible hunting skills. They work together to bring down large prey, such as zebras or buffaloes. Now, who can tell me about the distinctive feature of male lions? Spot on! Male lions have a beautiful, thick mane around their head and neck, which distinguishes them from the lionesses. It also helps protect their neck during fights. Now, let's discuss where lions can be found. Any guesses? Exactly. Lions are native to Africa and can be found in savanna grasslands and certain national parks. They have adapted to survive in these habitats. Now, let's appreciate the magnificence of lions and continue our exploration of the animal kingdom. Ten years old, huh? A decade. Double digits. A big one -oh. You don't like it? No, no, it's great. You hate it. Oh, I should have gotten you the Alex alarm clock. That's the one. That's the big seller. No, no, no. The, the, the present's great, really. It's just that another year's come and gone, and I'm still doing the same old thing. Stand over here. Try over there. Eat some grass. Look out. I think Motomoto likes you. <laughs> hey, kids. Take a moment and check out this incredible and extraordinary creature in front of us. Can anyone take a guess and tell me who it might be? Absolutely right. This magnificent creature is a hippopotamus. Gather around, kids. Let's practice that word as a team. H-I-P-P-O-P-O-T-A-M-U-S. Hippopotamus. Great job, children. Hippopotamuses, also known as hippos, are fascinating animals. Can anyone share an interesting fact about hippos? Spot on. Hippos are semi-aquatic animals and spend a significant amount of their time submerged in water to keep their bodies cool. Can anyone think of another fascinating fact about hippos? Exactly. Hippos have massive jaws and sharp teeth that can be quite intimidating. They use their strong jaws to defend themselves and assert dominance. Then, what can you tell me about the diet of hippos? Correct. Hippos are herbivores, which means they primarily eat plants and grass. 
They have specialized teeth and jaws to help them chew tough vegetation. Now, who can tell me about the size of hippos? Well done. Hippos are indeed one of the largest land mammals, with adult males weighing up to several thousand pounds. They have a robust and barrel-shaped body. Now let's talk about where hippos can be found. Any guesses? Exactly. Hippos are native to sub-Saharan Africa and can be found in rivers, lakes, and swamps. They are well adapted to their aquatic habitats. Now, let's appreciate the uniqueness of hippos and continue our delightful movie experience. You huge. Who's your friend? Or is that your bus? <laughs> Girl, you as quick as you all have to. So, you're Moto Moto. The name's so nice, you say it twice. I kind of like it, Fatso. I'll see you around, girl. It won't be hard because you so plump in. All right, children. That's all for now. Let's gather again in our next video to learn about more amazing animals. Goodbye, children. And remember to stay curious and be enthusiastic learners.